Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Before we go over to the next area, a quick change is in order with our purple coins. Oh, thank you, you have touched our mechanical hearts with your kindness. <laughs> yes, I know we can make our set way to the next kingdom, but... Spend money. I want the explorer hat and the explorer... whatever they call it. <laughs> Explore out for there. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work. <laughs> and yes, I will change now as well. There we go. I'll leave the rest of the stuff when I come back for it, but yeah. <laughs> just 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 get this for now. Let me just say that. Woo! Okay. Uh are you going to are you just going to talk about amiibo again? Ah! I just want to get some new dialogue and stuff like that before I head on over to the next area. <laughs> Excellent! <laughs> Woohoo! You are the best gardeners in history. <laughs> uh, yeah, that rabbit comes back, by the way. If you wanna, if you wanna grab that. So anyway, <laughs> uh, I mean, if you didn't grab it before, but anyway, um. So, before, remember I said don't fall off the edge, because, uh, well, uh, I wanted for the sake of organization, just keep that for later. Well, if you look down below, you'll notice that there's like a whole other dealio of, like, tree line in this area. See, this whole area is basically one big greenhouse. That's what this whole outer rim is. See that line along there? Yeah. Well... There's a different layer to this, and it doesn't involve death off on this side. Oh, oh! It's the deep woods, and Mario does not like this place whatsoever. <laughs> this is like Luigi's Mansion. So you can get seeds from this guy right away, if you'd like to, and uh, you can actually use them to leave the area also right away, just by plopping them in there and then climbing the vine up back to the surface. But we're not going to do that right now. We're going to go around the perimeter and look for a certain waterfall first. Because I have a certain suit. I'm going to get this in a minute here. That's a movable rock. But I just want to, for the sake of organization, leave that for now. There's a T-Rex wandering around here and it will attack you if it sees you. So be wary of that. But it's not, not really that dangerous or anything like that if you just stay behind it and yeah. Uh, anyway, I think it's sniffing around. I think it may have located me. But that's okay. We can go behind obstacles, and it will not be able to find us. <laughs> so yeah, where is that waterfall? Well, we gotta find water and then go upstream. I guess that would that would probably be very helpful. Up oh, there it is. <laughs> There's the T-Rex coming around that side. Okay, just just follow this up, and then I'll be able to get to. The location that I need to. There goes some lizards. Uh, okay, I don't know why I didn't... Okay, there we go. <laughs> don't know how I didn't see it on the way around. Maybe it's just further along than I thought. And he's like, I am providing security for this vault. I was told to only permit explorers inside. And this is why you need to buy that from the shop. Excellent, you are cleared for exploration duty. Enjoy the mysterious unknown. Go over and explore. Leave nothing unexplored. Okay, and this... There's not really much to explore behind this waterfall. It's just a chest. <laughs> Exploring for treasure. Okay, now... I'm stuck in the chest. Now we can go around and begin doing other stuff in a more, I guess you could say, structured manner. <laughs> so let's get ourselves back over to the start. Or, I guess I could go in that pipe. I don't know. I don't know. Well, that's, that's where I started at there. Yeah, I just I guess I should have just went around... Uh, the other direction, but details, details. You guys, just surprising me everywhere. <laughs> okay, yeah, I'm gonna go around the perimeter, just like I said I was going to. But, this time with more grabbing of everything. So here we are back at the start, and here we are at the rock. Whenever you see one of those little dots thingies on top of there, you can move the thing off to, <laughs> off to the side, whether that object likes to be moved or not, and that's as far as I can move it. Purple coins, behind there, 
And we're just gonna continue around the perimeter here. We're gonna go up to that tree, which is also movable, just like the cactus back at the Sand Kingdom. Let's go ahead and point 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 point. That's as far as I can move it. Oh man, I cannot be a tree for the entire level. Nor can I be a rock. But I can get a moon beneath the roots of the moving tree. And over here are a bunch of purple coins. Oh, and I also jumped off this edge thinking that there is maybe an even deeper woods. But no, there is not. <laughs> it is just cell shaded abyss. Uh, I could put a, another seed up over there, but eh, I don't know. Eh. Uh, I could also get the T-Rex. You gotta get its attention. <laughs> just gotta put it like, oh no! And then go behind a tree or something like that. And wait for it to do like a charge attack at you. And it's, it'll eventually do so. Uh, come on. <laughs> come on. Oh, there we go. There we go. It's doing the charge. And then it bashes its head into the tree. It knocks its hat off, makes itself dizzy, and then... <laughs> you can take it over. There we go. <laughs> I'll just break apart a bunch of things here, because why not? I'll just kind of hop out of my buddy here. Or, well, not but Oh, jeez, I'm stuck between its crotch. That is not, that is not good whatsoever. <laughs> a hard rock deep in deep... A hard rock in deep... Oh, shoot, it awakened! <laughs> Wait, actually, I need to... Get around that tree again. Oh, okay, you're, you, you've seen me, you've seen me, we're good. <laughs> it looks pretty dangerous, but it's not that dangerous. <laughs> anyway, it's even... I, I thought it even had its hat back for a second there, but no, no, no. <laughs> okay, come on. Come on, you can do it. There we go! <laughs> Let's rampage once again! <laughs> I guess this is a part of the whole atmosphere, is that because you got this... Big ol' T-Rex wandering around the area, being all spooky to your, to your whole area and stuff like that, but if you know how to deal with it, it's not spooky at all, it's more humorous. <laughs> I'll grab those up on top of that stumpy log that's embedded in the ground for many, many years, I suppose. And destroy the trees too? Sure, why not? We can do that too. There's a timer challenge down here. Uh, I wonder if I should... Well, as I said, I wonder if I should do that now. I don't know, I want to... I'm kind of having fun with my rampage. Oh, no, no, I want to... I want to... Dang it! <laughs> oh, no, no, I can again! <laughs> wait, I can do this with, by these coins here. Uh, oh, wait, no, I can't do that by these coins here. You, you don't you don't, even, you don't see me there? Man, your vision is not that good. Oh, you do have your hat back on. Oh, so I, I, I wasn't seeing things before. <laughs> Just a little hat. A little bit of... Accessorizing for our T Rex friend. And. Knocked itself out again. <laughs> and we're off! <laughs> I'm just basically destroying everything around here. Just, just before I. Because uh, I wanna. Yeah, what am I stuck on? Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say before I get to other stuff, and I might, might as well see if I can get this before T Rex awakens. Ah, come on. So, okay. Awaken! But this time under my command! <laughs> And go! Uh, I think that's about all that I can destroy with the T-Rex. I think? I Maybe? I mean, I could always just re-grab him in the future later anyway, so I guess it's not that big of a deal if I let him go for now. So... I guess I'll plop him here and go for that timer challenge. Which was... Ah! Which was... Somewhere down over here? Wait, what was this? Was this the th triple Goomba threat? No, it was called this. Anyway, uh, oh, that's another seed machine. Eh, well, seed steam gardener, I guess you could say. Not, it's more than just a machine. They have personality. Oh shoot, I forgot to destroy that over there. Well, where was the? Where did I lose the timer challenge? And how am I getting coins? Because I'm rustling up the grass or something. And yeah, the timer challenge was like, hello. My coin purse friend. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> yeah. Yes, you can also shoot coins at things. <laughs> yes, and you can also scatter coins everywhere by, sh <laughs> by shaking. Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh, there's even that to destroy over there, man. Man, I'm missing all sorts of stuff. One of my random wanderings. Okay, I'm gonna get out of here. 
<laughs> Get out of here right now. Dang it! <laughs> um, okay, where where was Timer Challenge? Timer Challenge, where were you? Hey! <laughs> uh, I passed by like five times and I didn't want to do it, but now that I want to do it, <laughs> uh, I guess I could just continue along the perimeter and see if I come across that again. Yeah, I'm sure I will, but <laughs> still, but still. But yeah, this place could be like a whole part in on itself for exploration duties, as you might have guessed, because it's, it's pretty big. It's a lot, a lot of stuff to see here. <laughs> um, hmm. Uh, oh, wait, wasn't there wasn't there a pipe up over here, like around the perimeter too? I mean, it wasn't that one. <laughs> oh, well, there's the timer challenge. <laughs> Okay, so you gotta get ourselves rolled all the way up over to that moon, which is like in the middle of things. Up over... Uh, uh, where what? Up over there. No, 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 don't disappear, don't disappear, don't, don't you dare disappear! Okay, I got it. <laughs> Glowing in the deep woods. It doesn't call itself a timer challenge, like, unlike the other ones, but it's definitely a timer challenge. So I'm not sure why. Um, over here, you, are, you can actually get some dialogue here based off of these coins. I think it's indicating that someone died here or something like that because you lose coins. That you cannot actually collect these coins under the water, but you can walk on top of them. Uh, you can react with like this though, I, 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 I guess, but I could have sworn there's dialogue here regarding this. Or maybe there, I don't know, maybe I was thinking of something else. I don't know, but anyway, let's continue along the perimeter again. And all that, I didn't dip, man, I really missed a lot of stuff, a lot of breakable stuff. Uh, yes, there could be something good underneath said Helix fossil breakable stuff. Where was that pipe? Where's the pipe on the high area? Oh, there it was. It's, all, it's, it's like everything that I'm saying, where is it, is the last place that I look in my in my total like turnaround this area okay so this is like a pipe maze it's like a trial and error guessing game I think it was like this uh, no it wasn't hmm yeah <sighs> uh, I'm not I'm not a fan of trial and error you know that <laughs> uh, okay so it was the left one first and it was not the middle one <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I really wish I would have written this down ahead of time. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah, I'll try the far right one. Ah, it's the last one again. This is why I don't like trial and error. This is like Mega Man. <laughs> only, only it's not based off of death. It's just, it's just guessing. <laughs> Guess, except it's just it's a memorization aspect. Okay. Um, was it this one? Please tell me it was this one. No. <laughs> I got five pipes at the end there. Oh, oh I can't even get it. <laughs> I'm so frazzled I can't get inside the pipe. <laughs> Maybe I should just try the middle one. I don't know. Some. Maybe the middle one is victory. <laughs> Who knows? I doubt it though. Ah, the middle one is, yeah. <sighs> uh, <laughs> this is I don't like trial and error. It's not, it's not something that's truly difficult. It's just something that just wastes your time for no good reason. <laughs> Okay, there it is! <laughs> Freaking! <laughs> Past the peculiar pipes. Never doing that again. <laughs> now, what I'm gonna be looking for here is, well, the T Rex again, but there's also a certain tree that has a certain pipe in front of it. I don't know if it's actually open now, actually, come to think of it. Hmm. But it's somewhere in the middle area, and I kinda wanna. See if it is around here, just for the sake of collecting stuff while I look for the T-Rex anyway to destroy more stuff. Uh, hmm. Hmm. I guess I could carry a seed around while I look for the tree. It was a, kind of in a... 
Well, there's this. That was That's not what I was looking for, but I guess I can grab those as long as I'm here. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a pipe on the side of a tree, and it contains another trial and error deal, y'all. And here it is, just kind of plop. Nah! Oh, wait, actually, you know what? I bet ya that those blocks came back when I went inside that door. So maybe I did destroy everything around there. And, yeah, and they just came back when I reset the area going inside this place. You know, the ex exploration place. Hmm. 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 <laughs> anyway, see, let's go. <laughs> Still looking for a certain pipe next to a certain tree. Someone there's my T-Rex, but now that I got a C, I kind of feel obligated to go put it, put it inside. A seating place because <laughs> we know the T-Rex moves pretty slow, so you can always go back. And yeah, I don't think you actually need to put all the seeds in all the places, but I just kind of am for the for the kicks. And uh, no, no trees. Well, I mean, yeah, there's trees, but I mean, there's <laughs> no trees with pipes. Hmm. 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 Maybe it was this big tree in the middle. Hello. <laughs> Hmm. There it is! That's what I was looking for. I'll just leave it here. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. I think it was this. Incorrect. Dang it! I got that right on my first try, actually. I guess it's, that wasn't that much memorization compared to that other pipe challenge. Okay, so it was boink, boink, boink. Yeah, I actually managed to get that right on my first try, so I don't... I didn't even know that <laughs> critters came out of that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so no chin chows for you this time, <laughs> and we are off. All right, T-Rex, T-Rex, T-Rex. It, it follows this uh, sort of like running grounds around here. Yes, if you do, if you go around in circles like that, you do spins, but that's it's not really useful for anything as far as I'm aware. But anyway, hello. <laughs> Come on with me around the tree and we will dance. <laughs> oh, you're getting, you're getting. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, 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 wait, wait, wait. There we go. <laughs> All right. We're a T Rex once again. <laughs> and we're off. And well, maybe I should grab those just for the sake of collection's sake. Yeah. Um. Okay, I, I don't think I bashed this apart in the middle here. Uh, no, no, I mean, maybe I, maybe I didn't, but there's, uh, I thought there was another moon beneath something. Ah, dang it. <laughs> Go! <laughs> uh, no, uh-uh. Hmm, I'll just keep wandering around as a T-Rex and demolish things as I see fit, because that's, that's what T-Rexes do in this game, I suppose. And also look for food, you can also destroy... Uh, pipes in certain cases, and I'll have to respawn later. I do. Bl oh no, I'm stuck! Eh, eh, okay, just did a charge again. Eh, danger, danger! I know, I know. I'm very dangerous. Okay, this is a thing that I wanted to destroy. And see what's inside. I said, see what's inside. I don't want to lose my T Rex again. <laughs> okay, there we go. Oh no, your, your tail is in the way! Okay, there we go. There was a second moon underground by the babbling brook in deep woods. Okay, give me the oh, and the shoot. Oh, shoot. <laughs> okay, follow me. We need, we need to uh, we need to go somewhere else now. Wait, wasn't there a, a breakable? Okay, no. I thought there was another breakable thing over there. <laughs> Man, this T-Rex recovers pretty quick. Um, let's chart. Did, you rammed yourself into that wall. <laughs> Fine, I'll, I'll get you over there. <laughs> yeah, we're off. <laughs> and I'll destroy. I think I got this before here. Now your foot's in the way! <laughs> oh, dang it. And then now don't you dare. Okay. <laughs> like, every part of your body gets in the way when I when I don't want it to. <laughs> well, actually, I'd never want your body to get in my way, but still. But still. <laughs> uh, another seed place up here. I'm just gonna... Kind of bash this open as coins. So yeah, there's a lot of stuff to find down here, I swear. Um uh, Hmm. Hmm. Uh oh sure, now I find that pipe when I don't want to find it. 
That's the only pipe in the middle of a, a big tree, by the way. Uh, this was the one that had a moon, right? Is that your foot in, your, in the way again? I swear to Arceus, I will throw you off the ledge. <laughs> oh, that's the same one. Well, that, oops, you, you stepped on me a little bit there. Uh, okay, I want to attract your attention here. Just because there's... No! Dang it! Dang it! <laughs> Get over here. <laughs> Just tap it on the foot. There you go. And... Do circles. And... Bunk. <laughs> this is the sound that it makes. <laughs> <It's>, oh! <laughs> uh, I guess I could we grab that for coins. But, yeah, I think I pretty much cleared this place out. Uh, for now, at least. I think I got everything. Can I destroy the vine for kicks? No, I cannot. <laughs> just so I would try that. Uh, okay, so I was through here. You got a good view of the T-Rex bottom. There's another, another shiny thing, but I'm pretty sure I bashed that before. Yeah, I just wanna get this really quick. I hope I don't get it before it awakens. Yeah, I got this. Yeah, it was a triple Goomba threats. Because it was, uh, hey. Because <laughs> it was between those, uh, decorative stones on the ground. Hey. Hey. You know I'm here. You know you want to do a charge. <laughs> Don't you want to do a charge? I think you want to do a charge. <laughs> it's it's kind of randomized when it does a charge. It's like you can't trigger it to do a charge on command or anything like that. Okay. <laughs> And our coin purse friend is hanging out down there, but well, kind of, kind of milked it of coins. <laughs> uh, just destroying all the botany that these guys work so hard to make, but that is okay because I'll just be able to grow it back next time that we spawn in the area, I suppose. Uh, so there's two, still two seed spots around the edges here that I can put seeds into, but I don't believe any of them lead to any sort of. Uh, prizes and I think I have rampaged through everything here so I guess I can leave him be and just fill up the rest of the world with seeds because yeah I don't really think I've got I found it again when I didn't want to find it destroy destroy <laughs> uh, I guess I'll just pop out of here Okay, so the, the other seed spots are right around the perimeter, like right along the edge of Doom. So, yeah. I just want to fill those up for the sake of filling them up. And then we'll, we'll call it a call it a part, I suppose. It's not a, a truly 100% the 100%. <laughs> yeah, I'll just kind of go behind you. You're probably sniffing me out, but... You're not that scary, I just kind of go around here and just kind of avoid you nice and easy. Yeah, but yeah, I don't think you need any of the seeds to get any sort of the moons. I think there are some, uh, some vines that do lead over to some moons, but the thing about it is that you can actually just jump at them from above, like I did with that one at the cliffside with the windmills. At least I think that's where one of the, the vines led to, but... Oh, you don't have a seed. Dang it! <laughs> you have a plant on your head. But yeah, um, the mo the vines are just primarily to get out of here, as far as I remember. So I'm just, I just I just want to fill up the vine holes. I just just put it that way. <laughs> One more. There we go. <laughs> just for the sake of organization. Well, not organization, but total completion of of tasks and stuff like that. All right, last one over at this corner. Let's -a go. <sighs> At least I think this is the last one. Pretty sure it is. There's only like four or five down here to get back to the surface. And you can climb up like this relatively rapidly. By the way, um, when you're on one of these vines when they're fully grown, it'll actually grow with you to speed up your climb anyway. Which is pretty nice. See, it just, just leads you back to the surface like that. And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when I re-explore the upper area, I suppose.